Hi, I'm Bill Myers, and this is another one of my video tips of the week. In this week's video tip, I'm going to show you a free program that you can download and use to recover deleted files from your computer. These files can be recovered from your hard drive, from a digital camera file or MP3 player, almost any device that you can connect to your computer. Let me show you what I mean. Now, the program we're going to use is called Recover, and you find Recover at pureform.com slash recover. When you get there, you'll see a link that says download the free version or get the pro version. I recommend that you download the free version. And when you do it, it's going to put a small program that you can install to your computer. When you install it, there is one little thing that you want to note. It will ask you, do you want to install CC Cleaner, which is a file cleaning program, during the install process. Now, you may not want to do this, so be sure to uncheck that install CC Cleaner. Once you have Recover installed, you can start it and it'll look like this. It will ask you, do you want to run the Recover wizard? In most cases you will because it will be quicker if you do it that way. Then click Next. What the wizard does allows you to choose which type of file you're going to recover. Now, this is important because in some cases you may have thousands of files that can be recovered on your hard drive. For example, I have a 2 terabyte hard drive and when I ran this yesterday it found me 4,000 files that I could recover. Let's not do that today. Now, the file types you can choose are pictures, music, documents, video, compressed, and emails. I'm going to choose pictures. So we click Next. And then it asks where are the files. And you can search everywhere on this computer, which means it will search all your hard drives. It will search everything connected to your computer. But in my case, because I have so many large hard drives connected to my computer, I'm just going to search an SD card. So we'll go down here. And there's my SD card that I'm going to search. And then I click OK. And then I click Next. And if this is the first time that you've done this search, all you have to do is click Start. But if you've done this search before and it didn't find the file that you wanted, you can put a check and enable Deep Scan and it'll look even further than the first pass did. So we click Start and it's analyzing my file contents. Here are the files that it found that can be recovered. Now, what's nice about this is that because they're picture files, it actually shows me a preview of what the files look like. So if I find a file here that I want to recover, let's say I want to recover this one right here, I just put a check mark on it and then choose recover. Now this is important. It says browse for folder. This is where you want to recover the file too. Now you never want to recover the file to the same device that you found on it because it may write over other files that you want to recover in the future. So recover it to a different device. I'm going to recover it to my E drive and then click OK. And it's recovered. You notice it's very quick and the file has been completely recovered. Now I can recover other files if I want or I can go to advanced mode. In advanced mode, it shows me the file name, and I can still see previews. If I want to see a preview, I just click on it, and it shows the preview over here. So again, if I want to recover something, I just put a check mark right there, choose Recover, choose the place to recover it, and then click OK. Now, because it's previously recovered that file, it's going to ask me, do I want to write over it? I I'm just going to choose Don't Recover that one, and then click OK. So it's pretty easy to do. Now, obviously, a software would be useful if you've deleted files or if you have a camera and somehow some photos got deleted or you've lost emails or you've lost video project files. So the software that we use is called Recover. You can find it at pureform.com slash recover. Anyway, I thought you might be interested in knowing about this. I'm Bill Myers. This has been another one of my video tips of the week. You can find more like this at www.bmyers.com.